Hello friends, Lord Verminard here again. Uh, actually, the, for the first time with this game, um, I'm going to play my garage today uh, because I've been wanting to play this for a while and I've watched Scapegoat play it again and it looks like fun. So I'm like, you know what? I'm going to get on that too. Um, so it's been about, uh, I think it's been about eight months since I last played this game, since I last fired it up. So we're going to just start a new game here. Um, we want the map extension. We want hard. Yeah, I'm going to try the hard start. That doesn't give you the garage right away. You got to buy it. So let's just do it. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, uh, like, like I said, it's been about eight months since I've played this. So there's been a handful of updates. Um, I used to play it with mods, but I went and, and whacked all those out for now. Um, just so this is a vanilla game. Um, fresh file, hard start. Uh, yeah, we'll just see what happens, I guess. Um, if it ever loads. Do, 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 do. Uh oh, let's whoop. Uh, tutorial. How do I close the tutorial? Um, close. There we go. All right. Well, at least I don't think I need a tutorial, but, um, I've n have never played this game with food before. So, I'm not sure how that's going to work. Um, okay, so I can't seem to open this. I can't turn any of this stuff on, right? All right. So, yeah, food. I'm going to have to probably just go to town and buy food, I guess. Um, all right. So, we've got our little garage here. Uh, okay. All right. Interesting. Interesting. Um, I think it's, uh, a, a strange choice to, um, to have a tire machine, but not a lift or an air compressor. I also kind of think you, you have to have a, I think you have to have a, um, air compressor to have a tire machine, don't you? Uh, I think so. <laughs> I don't know. I wish I had a tire machine. Holy moly. That would make life so much easier. But yeah, I don't have one. That's a, like one of the one of the few services that I um that I pay people to do on my cars and and that's um is there anybody who like write this no. I'm trying to think if there's a way to like rotate this to to normal, but it doesn't look like there is. That's all right. I don't care. Yeah, I, I do most of my own work on my vehicles, but um, yeah, I can't. Obviously, I can't do tires. So, <laughs> yeah, that's something I pay somebody to do. Battery charger. I, I'm trying to figure out why my dude can't pick things up. I, I don't know what's going on here. All right. <laughs> The controls are very strange in this game after you're used to playing like uh like um the long drive or mobile zoo. Like it looks like it should be the same, but it's not. <laughs> I get it. Like all Unity game all Unity games kind of look the same. Um but they can definitely play differently. Uh a wrench, I'm gonna need that too. Alright, so I guess the goal I have Excuse me, twenty five hundred dollars. Um, what are these welding rods? Yeah, I have twenty five hundred bucks. Uh, I think one thing I'm probably gonna need is a car. Um, uh, some way to get around. Um, because you can take the taxi. Move tool. All right. Oh, my screwdriver is just hanging out over here, too. Okay. Uh, you can take the taxi into town and stuff, but, like, if you need to haul a bunch of stuff, it doesn't work. Um, so, I guess let's start off with doing some jobs here. Uh, I kind of feel a little bit weird. What's up here? Ooh. There is... Oh, I can go in here. Okay. That's cute. Like a little, like a little loft. Or a finished attic or whatever you what whatever you call it. Um yeah. Okay. 
All right. Anyways, um, this is a nice little place, man. I wouldn't mind a place like this. Is this a bathroom? This is indeed a bathroom. Look at that. No sink. <laughs> All right. All right. Whatever. Um, it's everything we need. Okay. So let's do some jobs here. So, okay. There's races. Look at that. Really? Highway race, junkyard run, island race, quarter mile drag, rallies. We will buy your car. What is this? No, that's the, what does that say? I can't read it. Performance parts are in town. Okay. All right. So something wrong with shift. Ooh. Um. Sixteen hundred bucks. Okay. All right. So yeah, these these kind of jobs can be th these jobs can pay a lot here. Um. We've got a lovely Mercedes. Uh, let's see. Uh, I need to get this thing up in the air, I guess. Um, do I have jack stands? I don't have jack stands, do I? I didn't see any in here. Yeah, there's going to be a lot of fumbling around. I apologize. But uh, like I said, it's been a long time since I've played this. And, uh, and yeah, like, it just feels feels a little bit weird right now. Like the biggest problem I'm having is like why can't I pick anything up? Okay. <laughs> All right, there's a jack there. Let's put it where the jack point is supposed to be. All right. Um so sometimes you can get some of these bolts. I remember doing the tr the transmission jobs. They pay a lot usually. Okay, there we go. So we're loosening. Yes. All right. All right, so we want to stretch in there. Okay, get one of those starter bolts out. Probably going to have to get up under there to get the other ones. See if I can get some of the bell housing bolts over here. Okay, let's see if we can... Just... Subsume through the the vehicle this is totally normal this is this is the right way to do it um where are you there you are uh okay there's a bolt there ah i can't see the any of the other ones all right let's stick my face in here yeah, some of the cars, it's easier to do this on than others. Um, what is going... Okay. <laughs> Where are you? Oh, God. That one's already loose, isn't it? Okay, there's that one. All right, let's get under the car. If I can. Um... Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Don't crush me. Okay, we get that one. Got that one. Get that one. Um, I don't think I have to take the starter off. I don't remember having to do that. All right, there's two bolts there. There we go. It just fell right out of there. Okay. All right. So what is this? This is a Gearbox 4. Wolf Lad, Lad Coop, Neve, I6D. Gearbox 4. Is it an automatic or a manual? I can't really tell. Gearbox 4. All right. Let's see if we can see if we can order one of those. Uh, let's see. So that was a it's a wolf. Um, uh, nope. I six D. There we go. Uh, transmission. 
Gearbox 4 automatic. I didn't say Gearbox 4. It didn't say automatic, did it? Alright, I think it's this one. Alright, is this it? Please be the right one. It is. That's totally the right one, isn't it? Sweet. Alright. Let's heave it in there. Doink. Done. Okay. <laughs> Boy, I wish I wish doing a transmission was that easy. Alright. Uh oh, I need to tighten now. Okay. That and that. Um, let's do There's another dry shaft bolt, I think. Oh god. Where am I? What? Oh. Help. Okay. <laughs> Woo! Okay. <laughs> that was that was intense. All right. Um All right, let's put one there. There. Tighten that. Uh should be a couple over here. Okay, I got that one already. Um, is that? Oh, crap. Okay. Are you? We got, did we got them all? I don't think we got them all yet. Oh, God. This is making me nervous. <gasps> okay. Is Okay, I must have gotten them all because it's not letting me tighten anything else. Um, here, let's stand up. Uh, let's just see if it'll let me complete the job here. Bolts loose. Um, all right, now I need that 200 bucks. Let me see if I can figure them out. Uh, let's see. All right, um... That's yeah, closing the hood. We don't want to do that. Oh shit! Now we're in the car again. All right, maybe I can reach the drive shaft if I stick my head through the floor here. Okay, it's got to be around here somewhere. All right, we can see those bolts. Those are all on, right? Yeah, those are all on. I mean, it's got to be one of the drive shaft bolts. I, that's the only thing I can think of. All right, all right. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Okay, I need to, I need to get out of here. Oh my god, I'm freaking out. Okay, <laughs> get unstuck. That did not unstuck me. Okay. All right, let's try this again. Um, it came off the damn. All right. All right, we're off to a great start already today. Uh, we're gonna lower it before you can pick up the jack. So let's do that. Now I gotta get this turn the right way all right I'm gonna jam this like way under there this is this is totally the right way to jack up a card it's like right in the middle of the floor pan what could possibly go wrong okay oh, come on let me get under there why won't you let me Okay, those are all tight. Those are tight. That's got to be one of those, right? There aren't any friggin' bolts down here. Oh, there was one there. I wonder if that was it. I bet that was it. Oh, there was another one. That's it. That's That's got to be all. All right, here. Let's stand up, drop this, go over here, and... Oh, yeah. Look at that. Easy money. Well, that was fun. Okay, um, a successful uh, first job. Oh my god, this jack. Why are you pain in the butt? There we go. Jeez. Okay. Um, alternator belt. Nope, I'm not doing that. Nope, not doing that. Overheating. Eh. 
Can't start my car. Alternator belt, no. Battery wires are bad. Car is not moving. Well, that could be a lot of things, eh? Um, let's take it. It might be a transmission job. Oh, probably not. That's probably a friggin' clutch, I bet. Ooh. Well, this is nice. Very, very nice. All right. Uh, can I? I can test drive, right? Like, ugh. getting in the car is very awkward. Okay. Enter to sit. All right, it runs. Um, looks like it moves to me. <laughs> um, so, first gear. Uh, I it look it seems perfectly normal to me. I don't, I don't see what the problem is here. Actually, you know what? The... Okay, yeah, there's something definitely wrong. It's gotta be a clutch. Alright, let's get it back. <laughs> let's get it back into the. Uh, get it back where she's supposed to be here. I don't wanna damage it. Okay, so it does move, just, just not, just not very well. Okay, <laughs> that's definitely a clutch, I bet. All right, how do I get out of here? Whoa. Okay. All right. Yep. Sounds like a clutch. Um. Here, let's get this and. All right. <laughs> I wonder if I can get under here without, uh, without um, using the jack. Yeah, I kind of can. It doesn't, it doesn't like it. It doesn't like it very much. All right. Ah, uh, this weird, like, toggling to... Toggling to, uh... To crouch thing is messing with me. All right. <laughs> That's as high as it goes. Shit. Okay. <laughs> we gotta do this the hard way, I guess. Oh, I wonder if I can... Is it four-wheel drive? It is. All right. We'll, we'll jack her up by the by the pumpkin. That'll probably work. Or... Oh, yeah. There we go. Nice. All right. What if... It, are, you, are you just going to stay there if I do that? Yeah, that's definitely not a disaster waiting to happen. All right, let's see if I can, uh... <sighs> what if I do it by the axle over here? I'm just going to go that way now. Okay. So I can't drag the, I can't drag this thing up. Without it sliding all over the place like a weirdo. All right, we'll just try that and and see what happens, I guess. All right, so this transmission's got to come out. Um, oh, come on, you stupid thing! All right. Oh, this looks. Uh, surprisingly, like the uh, very much like the uh, the wolf that I was just working on. All right, um, there's no bolts on the bottom part of the bell housing. That seems kind of weird. All right, you can come out and you come out and you and you. 
Is that it? Where'd my wrench go? Oh crap, my wrench just like exited the world. Where'd it go? Uh Um, that's bad. Oh, there it is. No, that's not it. Where'd it go? Oh, that's not good at all. And this uh, transmission is not coming out. And it's gonna hard to be hard to do any of this work without a wrench. Where'd it go? Oh crap. Ugh. Oh, for God's sakes, where is it? Is it like inside the engine here? What the heck happened? Did it end up in the truck somewhere? There it is. Okay. Okay, wow. All right. This is fun. All right. What what bolts am I missing? I, I don't understand. So those are both out. Is there a drive shaft bolt that I'm missing? Oh my god. Why? Just I feel like you, you should be able to Reach under there a little better than that. Like, you know, that starter doesn't look too good either. <laughs> Why can't I go farther this way? Oh, God. I'm stuck. Oh, oh, God. Get yeah, unstuck. Okay. All right. All right. This is really, really difficult without the stupid lift. Um, Okay. See if I can get this under the the uh, transfer case here. Um. Okay. <laughs> I still can't get under it. That's a bunch of crap. See, I think... I think all those bolts are loose. Uh, there was one right there. Was that the one that I needed? Oh god, I'm stuck again. I'm stuck. Uh. Nope, there's still something holding it in. What the hell is holding this thing in? Oh my god, would you stop doing that? Just... Uh. And of course I can't move it. I feel like getting under a truck would be a lot easier than this. <laughs> Right. All right. Yeah, I had I had a Jeep Wrangler that it wasn't even lifted. It was very easy. I could just lay down and slide under it <laughs> and get to just about anything I needed to get to. I f I feel like this thing should be coming out now. Like I don't understand why it's not. Oh God, I'm stuck in it again. All right. You know what? Screw this job. I'm not doing it. Nope. Goodbye. Uh, Alright, let's find something else, I guess. Something wrong with shifting. Another transmission job. Um, I feel like I've learned my lesson with these. Air filter. I'm not doing that. Pistons. Uh, head gasket. 
Rust and repaint. Yes, let's do these. These are gravy jobs most of the time. Wow, a thousand bones, really? All right, where's the? Oh, it's a uh, it's a Neva. I've mentioned this like a million times. I don't think I've done it actually in video, but I really wish that we had these cars in the United States. I mean, what is not to love about that? It's like a, a smaller, a smaller, it's like a hatchback, but lifted. Like a, it's like a golf country, like a Volkswagen golf country. Like what is, I mean, holy crap. That would just be so cool. All right, let's... Get our grinder fired up here. I only saw one thing of rust. That guy right there, so. And just like that, it's gone. All right. <laughs> All right, so we look at this. Oh, it still shows rust somewhere. So we got to go hunting for it. Uh... Well, I don't know about you guys. I'm not seeing anything over here. Uh, hello? I, I don't see any rust anywhere. There's none on this apron here. There's none under the hood. Oh, look at that. Look at this. Okay. It was hiding from me inside. Oh, there's some on the corner here, too. Okay. All right. Well, now we know what we're dealing with here. I thought it was just that one little spot. I'm like, holy crap, that's an easy fix. All right, we'll just bunk. Now it's gone. Whoops. Open the hood. And I think I can probably just get in here and... Uh, nope, I can't for some reason. Really? All right. There we go. Yeah, look at that. Rust Annihilator. Okay. All right, now how are we doing? Rust is good. All right. So we just need to paint it. Um... What's the color? 441740. 441740. 441-740. Bunk. Alright, give me a can of that. Okay, here we go. Spray her down. Lovely. Oh, it's probably not going to let me do it from that direction, huh? Let me see if I can uh, get in the back seat. I'm pushing the car. Okay. Just everybody calm down. Now it looks like there's another little bit of rust over there. I wonder if they're going to ding me on that. Uh, let me see if I can get that real quick. Let's see here. Oh, yeah, I can see it right there. Ah, but it's not letting me do it from this angle. Man. All right, let's wrestle ourselves in here. All right, we're doing a little more than we wanted to. All right, I think we got it. Oh my god. No. What? Oh my god. Just... I'm stuck in the car. Ooh. Okay, yeah. The mechanics of that part of the game really need some work. <laughs> Jeez. It is extremely frustrating just getting in and out of the cars. Alright. Did that actually... Okay, that actually painted it, didn't it? Okay. 
let's close this and get this little spot that I screwed up. All right. And there's a spot on the hood right here. There we go. I think she's done. Looks good to me. Um, yeah. Okay. God, just... Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> There's so much stuff in this game that just drives me nuts. Look at that. We did it. All right, so we've got 4700 bucks. Um, let me take another job here. Something wrong with shifting. No, I really want to do those, but... Um, something wrong with shifting. Sits on even charging suspension parts. See, some of these jobs are I just don't want to do without a lift, right? Engine chain. Ugh. Don't tell me about my Volkswagens and engine chains. Head gasket, air filter, paint my car to match. Takes this job. All right, what are we dealing with here? Oh, well, we got ourselves a lot of. Um. Okay, so what do we want? Do we want the? Do we want it to be a different color? Current color five nine two five seven five. That doesn't look like the right color. Five nine two five seven five. Five nine two. Wait, five nine two five seven five. Right. Five nine two five seven five. Five nine two five seven five. Okay, that definitely is a different color. All right, let's just get one to make sure this is what we're doing here. Uh, sure, let's just start it right here. Okay, yep, that's most definitely a different color. So we got to do a full respray then. All right, but there's no rust to fix, so at least there's that. Ah, so we're going to be buying probably a million dollars worth of spray paint to do this job. That's all right. Um, these cars are pretty easy to paint. The wolves are the ones that are kind of tricky because there's lots of like trim pieces and crap that are easy to forget and hard to get behind. And Yeah, so we're out of paint already. There you go in there. Uh, let me throw away this one, this one too, so I don't get it mixed up because it looks very similar to that one. Uh, so let's buy three more. That should be enough. All right, let's continue here. I love that you don't have to take out like the lights and all that crap to paint. I mean. Like, to do it the right way in this game, you should do that, but um, I like that they don't make you do that, you know? All right, getting behind the bumpers can be a little bit, a little bit squirrely, but there we go. All right, I can't, can't forget the wheels, too. Oh, yeah, we're doing such a good job. Look at this. <laughs> Nothing like spray bombing a car. All right. <laughs> One of these days, I'll get that distance right. Here we go. Yeah, the, the, the spraying physics in this game are very odd. Like, sometimes it makes perfect sense and feels right, and then other times it's like, why won't you just go, like, you're, you're like, directly in front of the thing you're trying to spray, and it won't work. <laughs> oh, excellent. All 
great. We are the best car painters in the world. Okay. There we go. I got it right. I'm going to probably need another can. I still have that whole other side to do. Yeah. Oh, geez. Yeah, I'm going to need maybe even two more. All right, pride ourselves on efficiency here. <laughs> uh, stand up. There we go. Yeah, painting the tops of the cars is a huge pain because, like, for some reason, your guy just like he can't climb on stuff. So there's like almost no way to get up high to. To reach like the roofs of the cars. Yeah, I'm gonna need another can. Crap. All right. All right, let's go with one more. Let's hopefully, hopefully that'll be enough. Let's uh, see what we can do with that here. It's that spot right there. All right. Oh, look at this nice, nice uh, splotchy bit right there. That's fine. All right. Need to get the rest of that apron. Okay. This this wheel. All right. We got everything back here. Looks like we got that. That wheel's good too. Um, I see some splotches there. I see some stuff in the jams that aren't done. Let's see if I can whip through those real quick. Oh, you got to do the doors too. Sometimes they, sometimes the paint will go through the door panels just fine. Other times it will like refuse. To cover it. Ah, damn, I'm gonna need another can. Okay, can you stand up, dude? For God's sakes. All right. What is that, six cans? Hopefully this will be the last one. All right, hopefully that got the, the doors. I still see some some colors there that aren't right, but um, hopefully the game is going to be a little bit lenient on me there for that. We'll see. This can let's try to make it go all the way here. Okay. All right, let's open this. Um oh, I see a bit in the corner there. Let's open the hood real quick. Looks like we got most of that. Let's see. Uh, let's get that bit and that bit. And in there. Okay. All right, let's check it out. All right, color condition says good. So let's see if the let's see if they'll give the job to me. Oh yeah, look at that. Sweet. All right, yeah, that was only what 100 and 
120 bucks worth of paint for a 700 dollars job so we've got we've got let's see we've got uh we got about five grand in our pocket um i think what we should do is we can um junkyard there we go all right so we'll go to the junkyard here and uh ooh. um i think one of the ways you can really make money since i don't have a full garage without a lift some of these jobs are just going to be like ridiculously impossible to do right oh god we're loading stuff in Ooh. um this is not a museum take something or leave take okay yeah i'll take everything you got bud <laughs> Jeez, rude of course when was the last time you, anyone's been to a junkyard where the person was nice i've never been to a junkyard where somebody was like there's no cars here the hell what is this piece of crap oh my god it's missing it's missing everything does it have it even has a a partial engine does it have four wheels nope it doesn't oh my god see i'm trying to find like a beater i can just fix up but oh geez um this one's actually pretty straight That one's actually pretty straight. I might be able to I might be able to turn that one around for some cash. Oh my god, this thing is absolutely mangled. Oh, the interior is shit. Okay. This one's missing a seat and stuff, but all right, how much do they want for this thing? $7600? Oh my god. Really? That's all you got here? Bro. <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> I wonder how much we can make off of this turd. It's 4800 bucks. Huh. I don't know. This would be a pretty big risk. We'll buy it. We'll buy it and we'll uh we'll see how much of it we can we can straighten up and um yeah i guess uh see if we can sell it so we got 4800 into it right now let's tow it to the house and then we will take a taxi back to our house and where's the okay there's the car All right okay can I push it? Oh, yep, yeah, I can push it. Well, I could push it. Now I can't. Uh, excuse me? What's going on here? There we go. There we go. There we go. Whoop. Okay. Come on. Okay. <laughs> Come on. Just, just go a little bit farther this way. You can do it. No, don't flip it over. Just, just give it another good shove. There. <clears throat> okay. Oh yeah, look at this. This thing is a turd. Um, yeah, I don't think I'm gonna bother trying to do anything with the engine here. Um, all right, so it's the original color. It looks like the rust is bad. The color condition is pretty good. Ooh, excuse me. Um. All right, so I paid 4800 bucks for it. I wonder how much I can get for, for fixing it up. All right, fix that rust. That was easy. 
Uh, we got a little bit back here. For some reason my my grinder has stopped working. Okay, I don't know what's going on there. Oh, look at that. Just magically disappeared. I love it when it does that. Oh boy, we got a lot up here. Ooh. Come on, come on. Whoop. All right. Let's try that again. All right. I'm waiting for it to magically disappear, but it doesn't look like it's going to. At least not yet. Oh my God, wow. Okay, well, that's most of it on there. There's a couple spots down here, still need to get. Phew, that was a really rusty panel. All right. A smart person would have just hacked that off and put a new one on, but sometimes you got to do with what you got. Because it's not always easy to find panels for for cars nowadays, depending depending on what it is. All right. Uh how are we doing on rust now? Four stars, okay. So there's probably still some somewhere. Well, obviously the four is in the in the the oh there's some right there I can get to. I can't I can't clean the rest off of that. Um I can get these parts. Oh yeah, we got some back here on this uh on the rear apron too. And this is for some reason the, the grinder won't work. It's just it's dead. It, okay, now it's working. Now it won't. It must be a, like there's a distance thing or something. If I shove it a little bit in the garage here. No, not backpack. Yeah, it's it's not working. It won't let me grind this part of the car. What is going on with that? Okay, that is really weird. Why can't I grind you? What is wrong? Dude, what is going on here? <laughs> ah, this game is so freaking weird sometimes. All right. Let's clean her up here. God, that is an ugly color. Wow. Uh, 
Okay. Get this pile cleaned up a little bit here. And then we'll spray off some of these panels. Or spray some paint on some of these panels and uh, see what we can get for it. This is not a very good card to be doing this stuff to because it's because it was already in such bad shape. Normally, when it like that, uh, the Jesse, the the what's well, not an El Camino or is it an El Camino? I can't remember the stupid GM truck car things. <laughs> um, yeah, that would have been a better car to do this with, but they wanted. You know, eight grand for it or something like that, so. Yeah, she was dirty. Little yard dirt, no big deal. All right, that looks better. Okay, there we go. Um, just for fun, also if it's gonna let me grind back here, it's, it's not gonna let me do it. Like, why? Why can't I grind the back of this car? That is so weird. Okay, what's the color of this thing? Uh, clean state, five stars. All right. F forty-seven, one eighty-three. F four seven one eight three. Give me one can of that. I'll see if I can make it make it last. All right, let's get uh, that bit. And... Oh, come Ugh, so annoying. I want to, want to de-rust that spot so bad. It's like make it, it's like messing with my OCD. Looks like I missed a rest spot there, too. Ah, crud. All right. Oh, you know what? I didn't even check the jams. Uh, and I'm out of paint too. Damn it! All right, let me check the jams. I I don't know how much that's gonna make of a difference. Oh, there's actually not that much. Um, I don't know if that's gonna make any difference to be honest. Uh, let's grab the hose and clean this door off in here though. Interior's clean. Okay. <laughs> um, okay, let's try this grinder again. I don't know why it's acting so, so squirrely, but... Let me get that just fine. Uh... Yeah, it, it will not let me grind the back half of this car. I, I don't understand why. It doesn't make any sense. Oh, look at that. That rust just disappeared. All right. Ooh, smells in here. Okay. <laughs> Uh-oh. Am I stuck? Ooh. Yeah, I can't I can't grind the back of the car. I don't know what's going on with that. It's it's broken or something. I I don't know. I don't know. Hopefully that doesn't screw me. Um, Alright, let's get another can of paint and finish this up and see what I can sell it for. 
I have a feeling I'm going to be losing my butt. Uh, all right. Let's see here. This. Oh, another thing we forgot to do. Um, forgot to get the body hammer out and like beat the panels down a little bit. Whoa. Okay. I'm not sure what's going on there either. I think this car is like, is, is, is wigging out on me here. Oh, I think the door is stuck in the... Yeah, that's what the problem was. So I got some dirt issues too here. Yeah, it's nothing like like washing down your freshly painted car. <laughs> Didn't even let it dry. All right, water doesn't cost anything, so even though I think it's probably already clean enough. Spot down there that was bugging me. All right. Um, let's grab our little hammer and see if there's any panels we can straighten out. Again, I'm not so sure it's going to make a difference. Okay. It's going to keep clicking until something happens. Here we go. Oh boy, I'm hot back here. I wonder if it'll let me grind it now. That'd be weird. Oh, look at that. Oh, did we make it worse? <laughs> I'm not going to break out the Bondo. It's just going to have to be... Just gonna have to be crappy. Okay. All right. I guess we're done with that. Uh, okay. One more time with the grinder, just to see what happens. Nope. Won't let me do it. That is so weird. Okay. Uh, what's it worth now? Sixty-five hundred. All right, so we've spent, what did I buy it for? 48? Yeah, I still have some rust. It's probably from that back. If I could get that cleaned up, that would probably help me sell it for more. But I, it's for some reason, it's just, it's broken. I don't know why it won't work. So we made some, we made a little bit of money off of that. About a grand, I guess, after the taxi costs and everything. <sighs> Honestly, I think probably doing a doing a just a regular paint job from the from the phone would be easier. What do you guys think? All right, let's let's do one more. Yeah, let's do one more job here and uh, see what we got. Windshield is not clean. That sounds boring. Air filter, fuel line, shifting, start loud. Air filter, overheating. Let's see. Oh, painted body paint. Okay, it's only 120 bucks. Uh, I'll take it though. I don't have to buy anything. All I gotta do is slap some paint on it. Looks like it's just that door. Easy peasy. What do we got here? BCC F49. F49. That's the same color. B 
BTC F49, right? Yeah, okay. Right. Just paint right through your door panel here. So that's a totally normal way to do it. All right. I think that is probably good. Done. Easy money. All right. Let's do, let's do one more. One more. Since that one was quick. All right, we got a fixed rust job. Yeah, these can be good. Oh, twelve hundred bucks. Ooh, this one might be bad. Oh, and it's a freaking wolf too. All right, yeah, this one's not going to be easy. Um, especially since it's like dark. <sighs> okay, where's the rust at? The problem with the with the wolf is it has like tons of like extra panels and crap and trim pieces and stuff like it doesn't look like there's any rust at all in this car actually i'm not seeing any yet um oh did we get lucky <laughs> is it one of those jobs where right there look at that okay so there's probably some under this panel or this trim panel i bet well the rust says the rust isn't that bad maybe it's just that one spot boy that would be the easiest job ever if it was it's like it's gone uh all right, still says there's some somewhere. So I am I'm dubious. Uh let's grab this tool here. There it is, under the rockers. Yep. I like that they did it like that. I don't know if it's if it was coincidence or if the rust shows up like randomly. But that's totally a place where a car like that would rust, you know? Under those plastic covers and stuff. Alright, let's pop off this side too, because I bet there's some over here. Alright, that's clean. What about this? I don't see any over here. Look at that. Huh. All right. Um, let's put all this crap back on. Um, let's check the rust condition now. The color condition went down. How did that happen? Let's check the bumper. Whoop. Hey, I don't see any under there. Um, where the hell else would it be? Yeah, there is. I don't see any there. All right, let's let's take off. Um, I thought these inner panels came off too. Yeah, I'm not seeing any there. Looks like there's one more spot right there. Where's my grinder at? There it is.
I'm not seeing any other rust on this car. This doesn't have a hard top, does it? I don't think it does. So there wouldn't be rust on that. Um, still says there's some somewhere. Uh, I guess it's probably behind the door. Let's rip off the door panel real fast. Um, where is it? I see nothings. Oh, can I um? Do I can I take off this bit right here? No, I can't. How did I get back on there? That was weird. I don't see any more rust, guys. There's none on the door. So I can put this back on safely. Alright. Um, Alright, what happens if I just paint it? Uh, 133 E08. One three three E zero eight. It's a nice forest green color. Okay, um Stick these panels back on. I gotta spray that too, don't I? Yep. Okay. Um, are all these panels on? Yep, they're all on. Still says there's rust. Are you kidding me? Where could it be? Ugh. See, I see nothing on the rockers. I see nothing on the pillars. I'm going to be really upset if... I mean, this whole car looks fine to me. I wish there was a way that like the game would just give you like a hint like like what 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 am I missing here I've gone over the entire car like I don't even think I need to pull panels here because I didn't pull the door panel on the other side let's try that I guess what in the world is going on can you just take the wrench and there we go it wasn't so hard was it yeah I uh I'm probably gonna have to abandon this one I I don't know I don't know what else there is here I thought I had an easy job, but um, 
<laughs> no friggin' way. Look at that. No, wait. There's no rust in there. I thought all that was rust for a second. I was about to flip my lid. Okay, well... Yeah, sorry, bud, but there is no rust on this car. It is all in your head. <laughs> the customer is wrong. Yeah, I don't see, I don't see nothing. I could. I could take the whole rear bumper off, I guess, but I don't think that would, because I don't think there's a panel behind it. I know there is. But there's no rust on it. Look at that. I, I'd be able to see it right there if there was. There's nothing. Yeah, I think the I think the game is screwing me. <laughs> Damn. That was a that was a pretty good paying job too. That sucks. That sucks big hairy ones. Damn. All right, well, that's the way this game goes sometimes. All right, well, um, as Jeremy Clarkson would say <laughs> on that terrible disappointment, I think I'm going to call this episode for now. Um, but yeah, uh, abandoned. Yep. 1200 bucks down the toilet. All right. This one, all, the only thing I spent was uh 20 bucks on a spray can. So I guess that's not, not so bad. Ah, but yes, on that terrible disappointment, uh, ending this episode here. Um, this is kind of a bonus video uh, for this week. So if you guys want to see more uh, My Garage, you know, leave a comment below. Um, leave a like. You know, if you're not subscribed before, already, um, please subscribe to the channel. Um, and yeah, and if you like it, you know, I'll do more of this video, uh, more of this game for sure, because I really do like the game despite all the quirks and all the complaining that I did. So yeah, I'll see you guys on the next video. Take care.